What is going on YouTube? Just helping you out here. And for today's video, I'll be doing Chapter 3, Problem 23 in the Fundamentals of Physics textbook, 8th edition by Jural Walker, Halliday, and Resnick. Chapter 3 is all about vectors, and in Problem 23, we have an animal that walks from one oasis, and then after the trip, we are asked to find the distance the animal is from another oasis. So the first thing I want to do is draw a picture. So... We have, let's say right here, we have A, and then over here, we have B. This is 25 kilometers, and then we have a trip down here, and then up. And we'll say this is point C. So this is 25, this right here is 24 kilometers, this is 8 kilometers. This may not be drawn completely to scale, I apologize, my art skills are not the best. And then we're told that this angle is 15 degrees. So from this we know that vector AB is equal to 25 kilometers I hat plus 0 kilometers J hat. And so we need to find this vector here, which we can call AC. In the end, we're looking for this distance right here, so we'll call this distance D. But we're going to need this vector so we can subtract one vector from the other to find that distance. So AC, what we can do is we can find the resultant vector of this vector and this vector here, and that'll give us this vector. So AC is going to be equal to, we have 24 kilometers times the cosine of 15 degrees. Just make sure your calculator's in degree mode. I hat, that's for the X component. And our Y component, we have our 8 kilometers here minus 24 kilometers sine of 15 degrees and that's j hat and if you plug those into your calculator you should get about 23.18 kilometers i hat plus 1.79 kilometers j hat and now looking at this vector we can see that our x component and our y component are both positive and with this vector we drew up here our x and y component are both positive so we know that our drawing and our calculations match our expectations and so now we need to find this vector right here and we can do that with subtraction so vector cb so c to b is going to be equal to ab minus ac and that'll be just subtracting the components so here we have 25 kilometers minus 23.18 kilometers I hat plus 0 kilometers minus 1.79 kilometers J hat. And if you plug those into your calculator, you should get 1.82 kilometers I hat minus 1.79 kilometers J hat. And so now, this is our vector from C to B. And now to find that distance, all we have to do is take the magnitude of the vector. So the magnitude of vector CB is equal to the square root of the x component. So 1.82 kilometers squared plus the y component squared, negative 1.79 kilometers squared. And when you plug that into your calculator, you should get 2.6 kilometers. So that's it for this problem. If you found this video helpful, please drop a like, leave a comment if you have a question about something I did, or an idea for a future video. And lastly, please don't forget to subscribe and tell your friends about my channel so I can grow and help more of you guys out. I'm just helping you out. See you in the next video.